In my 17 years working in dental hygiene, I've come across many common myths or assumptions people have regarding our teeth. One of the common ones I hear a lot is, losing teeth is just part of getting old. Now that may surprise you, it's not true at all. Tooth loss can happen in older adults, but it does not have to be the case. While time and age can cause a decline in our oral health, it's not age itself that causes tooth loss. Hi, I'm Melissa, Senior Burst Ambassador and Registered Dental Hygienist. In my video, I'll be showing you ways to preserve your teeth to last you a lifetime. Now the aging population is increasing at a very fast rate, largely due to the aging baby boomers, people born between 1946 and 1965, like my mom and dad. Here are some interesting stats. The older population in the US grew from 4.9 million in 1920 all the way to 55.8 million in 2020. Now that's a growth of over 50 million older adults in 100 years. And that number is expected to grow to 90 million by 2050. One in five Americans is projected to be 65 years or older by 2030. Now we're also seeing this growth trend thanks to all the medical advancements. It makes sense that now we're living longer so we have a longer life expectancy. The National Council on Aging reports almost one out of four people older than 65 have lost all of their teeth. Let's lower that statistic. Here are five ways to help you enter your golden years with a full set of teeth. Now, the most important thing you can do to prevent tooth loss is to maintain good oral hygiene throughout your life. Brush your teeth twice a day, every day. Avoid scrubbing your teeth though. This can cause gum recession over time, which can make your teeth more sensitive and more risky for tooth decay. Do brush using a soft or extra soft toothbrush, preferably an electric. This one is the Burst Pro, which has super soft bristles. And electric toothbrushes really benefit elderly people because as we age, we can develop dexterity problems. And the vibrations remove more plaque and food bits compared to the manual brush. Now, electric toothbrushes often have a larger handle and ergonomic designs, making them easier to hold. This is really beneficial for individuals with arthritis or muscle weakness, which can affect their hand and arm mobility. Now, recession can also happen with gum disease, hormonal changes, tobacco use, or just simply genetics. Use toothpaste either with fluoride or other alternative options like toothpaste with xylitol or nanohydroxyapatite. These all help fight tooth decay and help your enamel stay strong. Floss at least once daily to remove plaque and food particles between your teeth. There are so many options on the market. Choose the one that works best for you. Preventing plaque and tartar buildup on your teeth will really help reduce periodontal disease, the most common reason for tooth loss. Also, certain medical conditions and genetic factors can also impact your tooth indirectly, like diabetes and autoimmune disorders. It's always a good idea to inform your medical doctor about any dental concerns that you may have. They'll provide you with appropriate guidance and refer you to a dentist. Smoking and excessive alcohol consumption can increase your risk of gum disease. This can lead to tooth loss, especially as we age. Let's not forget about increasing our chances of oral cancers too. Excessive alcohol consumption can lead to tooth decay, further increasing our risk for tooth loss. If you don't smoke, don't pick up the habit. If you do smoke, ask your dental team about smoking cessation, they can help you. Now a diet rich in fruits and vegetables and whole grains is essential for overall wellness and eating a healthy diet can also help prevent tooth loss. Fruits, vegetables, and other healthy options like cheese can give your body the necessary vitamins and minerals to maintain strong teeth and gums. And what you don't eat is really just as important as what you do eat. Sugary and acidic foods and drinks can accelerate enamel erosion and tooth decay. So limit these things really can help keep your teeth healthy and strong. Now, when it comes to oral health, you shouldn't overlook the benefits of physical activity. Regular exercise boosts circulation, which is critical for strengthening bones, teeth, and gums. As we age, this is so important. Along with exercise and other stress management techniques like meditation and yoga can also benefit your smile. When we feel stressed, we tend to grind and clench our teeth. This can really become a habit and make our teeth break down over time. Practicing stress management really helps lower anxiety and reduces the likelihood of grinding or clenching your teeth. You can also protect your teeth by getting a custom fitted night guard made by your dentist. Last but not least, regular dental checkups are crucial at every age. 
Routine cleanings remove plaque and tartar to prevent cavities, decay. This can all lead to tooth loss if you don't get it treated. Plus, regular appointments make it easier for our dentists to detect and treat oral health problems early before they become serious. Now, let's not forget about the significant advances in dental care. Digital imaging has made it so much easier for dentists to accurately diagnose and plan treatment. Laser dentistry has also become more and more common, allowing for precise and minimally evasive procedures. In addition, there are become advancements in dental materials such as tooth colored fillings and dental implants, so which provide better aesthetics and durability. Overall, these advances have allowed for more effective and comfortable dental care. Make good dental care habits part of your daily life, even better if you start at an early age. How we treat our teeth in our youth has a huge impact on how they hold up in the next 80, 90 years and do help protect the oral health of the older adults in your life. Emphasize daily dental care with them and assist them if they need help with their dental home care. This does include cleaning any dental partials that they may have or dentures. And don't forget to help them with scheduling their dental routine visits too. I do hope my video was insightful. If you have any other tips or experiences you wanna share, Drop them in the comments below and like and subscribe to Burst TV to catch weekly videos that my fellow Burst TV crew members create. Take care.